So today we're gonna to make a quick video explaining the differences between four of our Brute Force Prairie Shore 4 kits. So you can see here we made a little family tree of our four wheel drive conversion kits. Uh, you'll see at the very top, it starts with our Shore 4 actuator. Um, this is basically what replaces your electronic actuator and allows you to ride your bike with manual four wheel drive. Our first kit, our base model kit is our Brute Force Prairie Shore 4 Manual Two-Wheel Drive Four-Wheel Drive Actuator Kit. So just the basics of the kit itself is you get your manual Shore 4 actuator along with a manual hand lever. So if we open up the box here, just give you guys a peek at what's inside. You have some thank you cards, sticker, where to find the installation instructions and also an ad for our safe box. If you don't know what that is, you guys should check that out. So in your base kit, you're going to get um, hand lever mounting hardware. You're going to get the actual hand lever. Then here you'll see you have your actuator, your lid, your six pin plug that you're going to have to plug in um, when you replace your electronic actuator and then your pull cable for your manual hand lever. So now that we went through our base kit, uh, so your manual two wheel drive, four wheel drive actuator uh, kit, we're going to move on to the upgrade from that, which be which would be our Shore 4 combo. Now the Shore 4 combo comes with, again, your actuator and your hand lever, but what we did with this kit is we added our KEBC delete wire harness. So if we open up the box, Shore 4 combo, Again, you have your thank you cards and whatnot, but then you'll see as well, we added our KEBC delete um, with your hole cover. And again, you'll just see your mounting hardware, your hand lever, if you look underneath, it's the same thing. You'll have your um, six pin plug, your lid, your actuator, and pull cable. So as I said, your short four combo kit will come with a KEBC delete kit. Um, so what that is, is our KEBC delete wire harness and a hole cover kit with a six pin plug. So there are two main functions with our KEBC delete kit. Number one, it will bypass your KEBC that is originally installed on your bike. So a lot of times, if you have a problem with that actuator, it'll throw your bike into limp mode. This KEBC delete kit that we will provide will bypass that so you won't have that issue anymore. And another function is that it will get your two-wheel drive and four-wheel drive display lights to function properly. So when you install our Shore 4 combo, if you also install our KEVC delete kit, your two-wheel drive and four-wheel drive display lights will work. So moving along our family tree here, you can see we covered our Shore 4 uh, manual base kit, our Shore 4 combo kit, and now we move on to our tank lever Shore 4 combo. So you'll see here, it's a little bit different. You have your Shore 4 actuator, like I said, which comes with every kit that we have. Uh, but what we did with this kit is we upgraded the manual hand lever to our tank lever, which you can see right here. So let's take a look at what's inside our tank lever Shore 4 combo. Open the box. We have again, thank you card, sticker, um, installation instructions. Open it up and see, you have our lid actuator, and now you have our upgraded tank lever. So this is our upgraded tank lever. Um, you'll see there are two knobs. Simply press and rotate the knob to switch positions for two wheel drive and four wheel drive, and the same thing to switch into diff lock. So what's nice about the knob for our diff lock is that you no longer have to hold, press and hold the yellow lever on your bike. You get to get rid of that. Um, the diff lock knob on this tank lever replaces that. Um, also a cool feature with the diff lock knob is that the yellow LED indicator will turn on when you are in diff lock. Um, so that's now that we went through our first three kits for our manual four wheel drive conversions, it leaves us with our last most popular kit, our Brute Force Prairie Ultimate Kit. So with this kit, you'll see that you come again with your manual four wheel drive actuator, your tank lever, and also the KEBC delete. So let's take a look inside the box here. Brute Force Ultimate Package. You'll see here in the box, 
and then you open it up. You have your thank you cards, stickers, and an installation instructions card. You'll also see you have your KEBC Delete hole cover kit. Opening it up further, you'll see that you get your manual four-wheel drive actuator, your lid, and also your upgraded tank cover. So you can see we covered four of our basic kits. However, if you visit our website, you'll see that we actually offer a Prairie 360 Platinum kit. Um, what's in there is a Brute Force Ultimate Package along with a Prairie 360 Belt Light Bypass. Uh, if you're not sure what that is, you can again check the website. It'll give you a description on what that actually does. The reason why we didn't include it in this video um, for our family tree is because it's only made for specific bikes. Um, so it's definitely not as popular. However, like I said, if you want to see if it would fit your bike, just visit our website. So that's pretty much it, guys. Quick video to show you what the difference between our kits are. Um, again, we have this family tree. If you need to have that for your own personal reference, just shoot us an email. We'll send it to you. Um, if not, just give us a call and we can explain what is in our kits and which one will be right for your bike. Thank you very much for watching. Keep riding.